legend that is John Landau, the producer of Avatar and Titanic. He's here at our table. He's just been on stage. What was it like, John? First of all, anytime you describe me that way, I start looking for who you're talking about. <laughs> but, but thank you very much. No, being up there with Charlie was great. I think this is a great event to, to, to be with. I think there's, it's so much about being on the cutting edge. What, it's not about what's coming tomorrow. It's what's coming over the horizon. That's what everybody has to be thinking about. And I think events like this do that for people. How do you learn it? Uh, how do you experience it? What's the process there? Well, well interestingly enough, our challenge in, in the production process was not the 3D. The 3D came very naturally, um, and I think this is one of the big misconceptions, uh, both in the gaming world and in the film world, is that 3D is a huge learning curve. It's not. It's taking the same conventions that you've used in film or in gaming and, and applying it. Uh, we worked uh, for our live action filming down in New Zealand. We had a crew that had never worked with 3D cameras before in our camera department. We brought them on, just like you would train them on any new piece of equipment. We brought them on for about a week in advance, trained them, and began working with it. One of the great things about uh, shooting in 3D and HD is that you get to see it live. So anything we were doing, any questions we had, we got to see it live and make the creative decisions right in the moment. When I talk about theme, theme to me is the emotion and the relatability of something that you're, you're presenting. Too often times, especially in short films, people focus just on a plot. We have to get from point A to point B to point C. Okay, but why? What do you want the viewer to really take away from that experience? So in whatever you're doing, always ask yourself, what is the theme? What is the point of this moment from an emotional basis? You know, what our industry brings to the technology industry is that it can utilize the creative instincts and a creative vision to create new technologies to service what the story is that they want to tell. And around 2005, we really felt that we could be the impetus to push things forward and, and push the technology where we needed it to go. People then go, oh, is that the 3D technology? No, it's not the 3D technology. It's the technology of creating, engaging in emotive characters in a world like we've never seen before. That's what we're doing. Movies are about people. And I think you have to have an understanding of people, not just an understanding of lighting, if you want to truly become a filmmaker. Because we saw an opportunity with Avatar to expand the world and the universe of the, of the film and the movie uh, beyond just the big screen. And studios are not equipped to do that. Studios are worrying about the movie that's coming out next month, or the month after, or the month after. They're not looking at the big picture. So we wanted to look at the big picture so that together we could develop a plan for the, for the future.